Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this super easy DIY photo booth that is perfect for the holidays or for upcoming New Year's Eve parties. So to make the photo props, you are going to need some wooden dowels or paper tubes. You also need some cardstock and whatever colors that you want. I like cardstock because it is a lot heavier than regular paper and it will be better to use. And you also need some printables. So I went on to Google and typed in New Year's Eve and Christmas photo props and it came up with a whole bunch of little printables that you can print out on your computer. And I'm also using some paint and my hot glue gun of course. And I just wanted to show you guys this photo prop that I found. It's a chalkboard photo prop that I had in my drawers, so I just grabbed that as well. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys how to make is the Santa hat. So it's super easy. You just want to take some cardstock and you want to trace a little triangle onto the cardstock. And I rounded out the triangle because the Santa hats aren't usually straight, exactly triangles. So I just kind of rounded it out to make it look a little softer. And I just cut it out. And then I just took my white paper and I used regular paper for this part and I just traced a little squiggly bubble as you guys can see here but you just want to trace that sort of shape. It doesn't have to be perfect because it's not perfect in real life. So I just cut it out and cut out a little white circle and I glued the circle on the top of the hat and glued the little squiggly shape to the bottom of the hat. And then on the back you just want to take your wooden dowel or paper tube and want to glue it. You can choose to glue it in the center or you can glue it on the side depending on how you want it to look. If you glue it on the side then when you put it up to your head it'll look like you were actually wearing it so that's why I put it on the side like so. And just secure the wooden dowel or paper tube with some more hot glue on the sides. So now I'm going to show you guys how to make this present photo prop. So I'm just taking some blue cardstock and I'm just going to cut it into a triangle and you can use any colors that you want and you can make the present however big or how small you want it to be. So I just want to say here guys, all of these little photo props are super easy to make. I'm just showing you guys some ideas so I know that even though these are a lot of self-explanatory ideas, I just wanted to all of them because some people might not know of these ideas. So for the little ribbon I just took some orange cardstock and cut it into little strips as you can see and I just made sure that the strips would fit across and downwards on the little present and then I cut out a bow shape and glued it to the top of the present and then I cut out a circle to be the center of the bow. So once you make it, once again, you just take your wooden dowel or paper tube and you want to glue it to the back of the present. And the possibilities are endless of how many different photo props that you can make and create. And if you want some inspiration, I will link down below some DIY photo props websites that you can go and see some more ideas like Pinterest. So for the printables, you just want to print out your little printable onto some cardstock because cardstock is a lot thicker than regular paper. So just make sure that you replace your printer paper with cardstock. And then once you print it out, you can just cut it out and once again, glue that wooden dowel or paper tube onto the back and then you're done. So for the backdrop, I just took some wrapping paper in the design that I want and taped it onto the wall in my house. And then I just made a little holder for all of my photo props to go in. And now you are all done and you can have so much fun with this. You can use this as a dress up station or you can choose to take lots and lots of pictures with your friends and family during the holidays.